While many foods nourish and sustain us, some come with lethal risks, if not properly prepared or consumed. This video explores 20 of the deadliest foods around the globe, some exotic, some surprisingly common, that you should approach with extreme caution. Number 1. Fugu, Pufferfish Fugu, or pufferfish, is a delicacy in Japan that can be lethal if not prepared meticulously by a certified chef. The fish contains tetrodotoxin, a neurotoxin over 1,000 times more potent than cyanide. There is enough tetrodotoxin in a single pufferfish to kill 30 adult humans, and there is no known antidote. Eating fugu that has been improperly prepared can lead to paralysis and death within hours. The danger lies primarily in the liver, ovaries, and skin of the fish, which contain the highest concentration of the toxin. While highly trained and certified chefs know how to remove these dangerous parts, the risk of human error is always present. Despite the danger, fugu remains a popular dish in Japan, often served as sashimi or in a hot pot. However, the Japanese government strictly regulates the preparation and sale of fugu, requiring chefs to undergo rigorous training and certification, which can take several years to complete. Even with these safeguards, there are occasional cases of fugu poisoning, mostly from amateur chefs attempting to prepare the dish at home. The symptoms of fugu poisoning include dizziness, nausea, and difficulty breathing, progressing to paralysis and death if not treated immediately. Number 2. Cassava Cassava is a root vegetable commonly consumed in Africa, South America, and parts of Asia. It is a staple food for millions of people, but contains naturally occurring cyanogenic glycosides, which can produce cyanide when the root is not properly prepared. Eating improperly processed cassava can lead to cyanide poisoning, which can cause symptoms like dizziness, headaches, and confusion, and can be fatal in severe cases. The roots must be peeled and cooked thoroughly to remove the toxins. In some cultures, cassava is soaked in water and fermented to reduce its toxic content. However, failure to prepare cassava correctly can result in acute poisoning or even chronic issues like goiters and nerve damage in cases of long-term exposure. Cassava is an essential source of carbohydrates in many developing countries, but it is also a food that comes with inherent risks. Some variants of cassava, known as bitter cassava, contain higher levels of toxins and are generally avoided or specially treated to reduce their toxic content. The preparation methods vary from region to region, but the underlying principle is the same, to neutralize the cyanogenic glycosides and make the root safe for consumption. Number 3. Rhubarb Leaves Rhubarb is often thought of as a fruit, but it's technically a vegetable. While its stalks are commonly used in pies and jams, the leaves are toxic and should never be consumed. The leaves contain high levels of oxalic acid and anthraquinone glycosides, substances that can cause severe poisoning. Consuming even a small amount of rhubarb leaves can result in a range of symptoms, including stomach pain, nausea, and vomiting. In more severe cases, ingesting these leaves can lead to kidney failure, seizures, and even death. The toxic components are water-soluble, but boiling the leaves only concentrates the toxins rather than eliminating them. Unlike some of the other foods on this video, there's no safe way to prepare rhubarb leaves for consumption. They should be completely avoided. In cases of accidental ingestion, immediate medical attention is crucial. The treatment typically involves supportive care, such as intravenous fluids and medications to control symptoms, but there is no antidote for the toxins in rhubarb leaves. Number 4. Sanakji, Live Octopus Sanakji is a Korean delicacy that involves consuming a live octopus. The dish is typically served immediately after the octopus is killed, and the tentacles are still moving when they arrive at the table. While this might seem like an exotic and thrilling culinary experience, it comes with significant risks. The primary danger is the suction cups on the tentacles, which can adhere to the mouth and throat, posing a choking hazard. Every year there are reported cases of people choking to death while consuming Sanakji. The octopus itself is not toxic, but the way it is consumed makes it a high-risk dish. It is crucial to chew the tentacles thoroughly before swallowing to ensure that the suction cups lose their grip. However, the rush and excitement often lead people to underestimate this danger. Even for those who navigate the choking hazards, there's still the risk of parasitic infection. Raw octopus can carry parasites like anisakis, 
which can lead to severe gastrointestinal issues if ingested. Some people also experience allergic reactions to the octopus, manifesting symptoms ranging from mild itchiness to anaphylactic shock. Number 5. Elderberries Elderberries are often praised for their health benefits, particularly their ability to boost the immune system. However, raw elderberries, as well as the leaves, seeds, and bark of the elderberry plant, contain cyanogenic glycosides, which can produce cyanide when ingested. Consuming raw or improperly prepared elderberries can lead to cyanide poisoning, causing symptoms like nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea. In severe cases, it can lead to more serious conditions such as seizures, coma, or even death. To make elderberries safe for consumption, they must be cooked thoroughly, usually by boiling. Many people consume elderberries in the form of syrups, jams, or teas, which are generally safe as long as the berries have been properly cooked. However, consuming homemade preparations that have not been adequately cooked or consuming the berries raw is risky. Even when cooked, it's essential to strain out the seeds to minimize the risk further. Despite the potential health benefits, elderberries are a food that must be treated with caution. Number 6. Aki Aki is the national fruit of Jamaica and a key ingredient in the traditional dish aki and salt fish. While it's a beloved part of Jamaican cuisine, aki comes with a potentially lethal risk if consumed improperly. The fruit contains hypoglycin A and B, toxins that can lead to what is known as Jamaican vomiting sickness. This condition can induce severe vomiting, hypoglycemia, and even lead to coma or death in extreme cases. The danger lies in the unripe ackee fruit as well as its seeds, both of which contain high levels of hypoglycin. Only the ripe fruit's fleshy arils are safe to eat, and even these must be cooked thoroughly. To make matters more complicated, it can be difficult to tell when the fruit is truly ripe, as the levels of hypoglycin can vary. The fruit must naturally open and reveal its seeds before it is considered safe for consumption. Even then, it's crucial to remove the seeds and cook the arils fully to neutralize any remaining toxins. Due to these risks, the importation of aki into some countries, like the United States, is strictly regulated to ensure that only the safe parts of the fruit are sold. Despite the potential hazards, aki remains an important cultural and culinary symbol in Jamaica. Number 7. Giant Bullfrog the giant bullfrog native to parts of Africa is considered a delicacy in some regions. However, consuming this amphibian comes with its own set of risks. The skin and internal organs of the giant bullfrog contain a variety of toxic substances that can be harmful or fatal if ingested. These toxins can lead to kidney failure or even death if the frog is not prepared correctly. In certain areas, only experienced hunters and cooks will handle the giant bullfrog as they know how to properly prepare it to neutralize the toxins. Typically, the skin and internal organs must be completely removed, and the remaining meat must be cooked thoroughly. Failure to follow these steps can result in severe poisoning. Despite the risks, the frog is a sought-after delicacy, often grilled or used in stews. Some believe that consuming the frog can impart strength or other beneficial qualities, but these beliefs are not backed by scientific evidence. What is clear, however, is that the giant bullfrog is a food that should only be consumed when prepared by individuals who understand the risks and the necessary precautions to render it safe for consumption. Number 8. Blood Clams Blood clams, native to the coastal areas of the Indo-Pacific, have earned their name from the red hemoglobin liquid inside their soft tissues. They are a delicacy in some Asian countries, often consumed raw or lightly boiled. However, this culinary practice poses severe health risks. Blood clams are known to be carriers of several viruses and bacteria, including hepatitis A and E, typhoid, and dysentery. Consuming the clams raw or undercooked can lead to severe, sometimes fatal, illnesses. The risk is exacerbated by the clam's habitat, often in polluted or low-oxygen environments, which makes them more susceptible to harboring dangerous pathogens. Some regions have imposed bans or restrictions on the harvesting and sale of blood clams due to these health risks. However, they are still consumed in some areas, often by those unaware of the potential dangers. Cooking the clams thoroughly can kill most of the harmful microorganisms, but the risk is not entirely eliminated. Even cooked, the clams can still cause allergic reactions in some people. 
the potential health risks far outweigh the culinary appeal of blood clams, making them a food item that is best avoided unless you are certain of their origin and how they have been prepared. Number 9. Kazumarzu Kazumarzu is a traditional Sardinian cheese that's infamous for its extreme fermentation process, which involves the deliberate introduction of live maggots into the cheese. The larvae of the cheese fly break down the fats in the cheese, making it soft and spreadable. While this may sound intriguing to adventurous eaters, Kasu Marzu comes with a host of health risks. The maggots can survive the acidic environment of the human stomach, leading to a condition known as pseudomyosis, a parasitic infection of the digestive tract. Symptoms can include abdominal pain, nausea, and vomiting. Moreover, the maggots can jump up to six inches when disturbed, posing a risk of them entering other parts of the body if the cheese is consumed improperly. Due to these health concerns, Kasu Marzu has been banned in many countries, including those in the European Union. However, it is still made and consumed in some parts of Sardinia, often in violation of the law. Those who do choose to eat Kasu Marzu usually cover their eyes and hold their hands above the cheese to prevent the maggots from leaping. Number 10. Silver Stripe Blasop The Silver Stripe Blasop is a type of toadfish found in the waters of the Indo-Pacific, particularly around Australia and Southeast Asia. While it may look like an ordinary fish, it contains potent neurotoxins in its liver and reproductive organs. Consuming even a small portion of these parts can lead to paralysis and death. There is no known antidote for the toxin, making it a particularly dangerous food item. Despite the risks, the fish is sometimes consumed in some local communities, either due to a lack of awareness or the belief that proper preparation can make it safe. Traditional cooking methods involve removing the toxic organs and cooking the fish thoroughly, but even these steps do not guarantee safety, as traces of the toxin can remain. The risks of consuming silver stripe blasop are so significant that many countries have imposed restrictions on its sale and consumption. Even catching it accidentally while fishing can be risky, as the toxin can be absorbed through the skin or via small cuts, leading to poisoning. The deadly nature of this fish makes it a food that should be avoided at all costs, unless prepared by experts who are fully aware of the risks and know how to mitigate them. Number 11. Ceviche, undercooked seafood. Ceviche is a popular dish in Latin American cuisine, particularly in coastal regions where fresh seafood is abundant. The dish consists of raw fish or shellfish that's marinated in citrus juices, usually lemon or lime, which denature the proteins and give it the appearance of being cooked. While ceviche is a culinary delight for many, it poses significant health risks due to the fact that the seafood is essentially raw. Consuming undercooked or raw seafood exposes you to a variety of pathogens, including bacteria like Vibrio, parasites such as Anisakis, and viruses like Hepatitis A. Even though the acidity of the citrus juice may kill some bacteria, it's not sufficient to eliminate all pathogens or parasites. The risks are especially high for those who are immunocompromised, pregnant, or suffering from liver conditions. Some people also experience allergic reactions to the raw fish, which can range from mild to severe. To minimize the risks, it's crucial to use only the freshest seafood from reputable sources and to marinate it for an adequate amount of time. However, these measures do not guarantee complete safety. In many countries, commercial ceviche is required to undergo a freezing treatment to kill parasites, but this method is not foolproof against all types of pathogens. For those who relish this dish, it's a gamble that comes with potential health consequences. Number 12. Mushrooms Mushrooms are a common food item enjoyed by many, but they can also be incredibly dangerous if you're not careful. While there are numerous edible varieties, there are also many toxic species that closely resemble their harmless counterparts. Consuming toxic mushrooms can lead to a range of symptoms, from mild gastrointestinal upset to severe poisoning that can result in liver failure, neurological damage, and death. Some of the most dangerous species include the death cap, destroying angel, and the autumn skull cap. These mushrooms contain potent toxins that have no known antidotes. Mistaking them for edible varieties can be a fatal error. Even experienced foragers can sometimes make mistakes, which underscores the risks involved in mushroom consumption. In many cases, cooking or boiling does not neutralize the toxins. 
The only way to ensure safety is to consume mushrooms that have been properly identified by experts. If there's any doubt about the edibility of a mushroom, it's best to err on the side of caution and avoid consumption. With Mushrooms, the stakes are incredibly high and the margin for error is slim. They serve as a cautionary tale of how something as seemingly benign as a food item can turn deadly. Number 13. Nutmeg. Nutmeg is a commonly used spice that adds a warm, nutty flavor to a variety of dishes. However, what many people don't realize is that it can be highly toxic when consumed in large amounts. The spice contains a compound called myristicin, which has hallucinogenic properties and can lead to a condition known as nutmeg poisoning. Symptoms can include nausea, vomiting, and abdominal pain, as well as more severe neurological symptoms like hallucinations, anxiety, and a sense of impending doom. In extreme cases, high doses can lead to seizures, organ failure, and death. The amount needed to trigger these symptoms can vary from person to person, but is generally considered to be around 2 to 3 teaspoons for most adults. Even smaller amounts can cause problems for children or pets. Treatment for nutmeg poisoning is mainly symptomatic, as there is no specific antidote. It may include activated charcoal to absorb the toxin, intravenous fluids for hydration, and medications to control symptoms like nausea and seizures. Given these risks, it's crucial to use nutmeg sparingly and to keep it out of reach of children and pets. While it may seem like a benign, everyday spice, nutmeg is a potent substance that should be handled with care, underscoring the principle that even common foods can become dangerous when misused. Number 14. Starfruit Starfruit, also known as carambola, is a tropical fruit that is not only delicious, but also visually appealing due to its star-shaped cross-section. However, this exotic fruit can be deadly for certain individuals, particularly those with kidney problems. Starfruit contains a neurotoxin that most healthy kidneys can filter out without issue, but for those with impaired kidney function, this is not the case. Consumption can lead to starfruit intoxication, whose symptoms include mental confusion, seizures, and even death in severe cases. The toxin can affect the brain and cause irreversible damage. Dialysis is often required to remove the toxin, but this is not always effective, and there is no specific antidote. Even individuals with healthy kidneys should consume starfruit in moderation, as excessive consumption can lead to kidney damage and increase the risk of toxicity. Due to these risks, some healthcare providers recommend that people with any form of kidney disease avoid starfruit entirely. While it may be a tempting and exotic treat, starfruit is a food that demands respect and caution, especially for those with pre-existing health conditions. Number 15. Apricot Kernels Apricot kernels are the seeds found inside the pit of the apricot fruit. While they are often promoted for their purported health benefits, including claims that they can fight cancer, these seeds pose a significant risk when consumed in large amounts. Apricot kernels contain amygdalin, a substance that converts into cyanide when metabolized by the human body. Cyanide is a potent poison that can cause symptoms such as headache, nausea, dizziness, and in higher doses, respiratory failure and death. The lethal dose for humans is estimated to be around 0.5 to 3.5 milligrams per kilogram of body weight and just a small handful of apricot kernels can be enough to reach this threshold. Despite the risks, some people continue to consume apricot kernels, often in the form of oil or as an ingredient in traditional medicines. Regulatory agencies like the Food and Drug Administration in the United States have issued warnings against the consumption of apricot kernels and have banned the sale of products. That contain unsafe levels of amygdalin, Treatment for cyanide poisoning from apricot kernels includes immediate medical intervention with antidotes like hydroxocobalamin or sodium thiosulfate, along with supportive care such as oxygen therapy. The bottom line is that while apricot kernels may seem like a natural and healthy option, they are a high-risk food that should be consumed with extreme caution, if at all. Number 16. Hakarl, Fermented Shark Hakarl is a traditional Icelandic dish made from Greenland shark, a species that lives in the cold, deep waters of the North Atlantic. 
The shark itself is poisonous when fresh due to high levels of urea and trimethylamine oxide, which convert into toxic compounds when ingested. The traditional preparation method involves fermenting the shark meat for several months to allow these toxins to break down. The result is a strong-smelling, acquired-taste delicacy that is enjoyed by some, but reviled by others. While the fermentation process does make the shark safe to eat, consuming improperly prepared hakarl can lead to symptoms similar to those of extreme alcohol intoxication, including dizziness, nausea, and loss of coordination. In severe cases, it can cause convulsions and unconsciousness. Furthermore, hakarl is often consumed as part of a ritual that includes drinking brenovin, a potent Icelandic schnapps, which can exacerbate these symptoms. Due to the unique and specialized preparation required, it's a dish best left to experts. Even when prepared correctly, hakarl is an acquired taste that comes with its own set of risks, making it a dish for the adventurous who are aware of the potential hazards. Number 17. Kidney Beans Kidney beans are a staple in many cuisines, from chili to salads, and are a great source of protein and fiber. However, what many people don't realize is that they can be extremely toxic if not prepared correctly. Raw kidney beans contain a natural toxin called phytohemagglutinin, which can cause severe gastrointestinal distress, including symptoms like nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea. In some cases, the toxin can lead to hospitalization. Cooking the beans thoroughly neutralizes this toxin, making them safe to eat. Boiling them for at least 10 minutes is generally considered sufficient, but slow cooking at low temperatures can actually increase the toxin levels and should be avoided. Canned kidney beans are usually pre-cooked and are safe to consume without additional cooking. However, if you are using dried beans, it's crucial to boil them for the recommended time to ensure they are safe to eat. Despite their nutritional benefits, improperly prepared kidney beans pose a significant health risk. It's a stark reminder that even familiar and commonly consumed foods can become dangerous when not handled correctly. Number 18. Potatoes, green parts and sprouts. Potatoes are one of the most widely consumed vegetables in the world, used in a variety of dishes from fries to stews. However, certain parts of the potato plant, specifically the green portions of the skin and the sprouts, contain toxic alkaloids like solanine and shacanine. Consuming these parts can lead to potato plant poisoning, with symptoms ranging from mild gastrointestinal upset to more severe conditions like vomiting, diarrhea, and even coma or death in extreme cases. The green coloration is a result of chlorophyll production, which itself is not harmful, but serves as an indicator that harmful levels of alkaloids may be present. To minimize risk, it's advisable to peel potatoes and remove any green parts or sprouts before cooking. Cooking, frying, or baking does not eliminate these toxins, so removal is essential. Some people are more sensitive to these alkaloids and may experience symptoms even at lower levels. For those who grow potatoes, proper storage away from light can prevent sprouting and the development of toxic compounds. In summary, while potatoes are generally safe and nutritious, they can pose health risks if consumed improperly. Number 19. Cherry and Peach Pits Cherries and peaches are beloved fruits that offer a sweet and juicy indulgence, especially during their peak seasons. However, the pits or stones of these fruits contain cyanogenic compounds, specifically amygdalin, which can release cyanide when ingested in large quantities. A single pit may not be enough to cause harm, but consuming multiple pits or chewing them can potentially result in cyanide poisoning. Symptoms include headache, dizziness, rapid breathing, and, in extreme cases, can lead to respiratory failure and death. Unfortunately, there have been cases where individuals have attempted to consume the pits for their purported health benefits, only to end up with severe poisoning. Treatment for cyanide exposure typically involves immediate medical intervention, with specific antidotes such as hydroxocobalamin and other supportive treatments like oxygen therapy. The key to safe consumption is to avoid chewing or ingesting the pits. For those who enjoy making homemade jams or other dishes that involve processing these fruits, it's crucial to remove the pits entirely to ensure that no cyanogenic compounds make their way into the final product. While cherries and peaches themselves are a healthy choice, their pits are a hidden hazard that demands caution. Number 20. Absinthe. 
Absinthe, often referred to as the Green Fairy, is a potent alcoholic beverage that has a long history of both artistic allure and public controversy. It is made from botanicals like wormwood, anise, and fennel, and it is the wormwood that contains thujone, a compound that can be toxic in high doses. Thujone can affect the nervous system, leading to symptoms like hallucinations, seizures, and even death in extreme cases. In the early 20th century, absinthe was banned in many countries due to its supposed psychoactive effects and potential for toxicity. Modern absinths, however, are manufactured under regulations that limit thujone levels to safe amounts, generally making them as safe as any other high-proof alcoholic beverage when consumed responsibly. However, homemade or bootleg versions of absinthe may not adhere to these safety guidelines and can pose significant risks. In addition to thujone, the high alcohol content of absinthe can lead to acute alcohol poisoning if consumed in excess. As with any alcoholic beverage, moderation and responsible consumption are key to enjoying absinthe safely.